Hello everyone, G2G TV here with a new Rock Band 4 video series. Every week in the Rock Band forums, we find out the top 50 most sold DLC singles and packs on Xbox One. I always find them interesting. I would like to talk about them and analyze it a bit. I'm not gonna make the video super long, so I will talk about the top 10 and go through some of the interesting changes. If you want more videos about the top 50 most sold DLC on Xbox One, make sure to like the video because it helps a lot. The number one spot two weeks in a row has been stressed out by 21 pilots. Yeah, it even beat the Justin Bieber songs last week, which is huge. It means either that stressed out has sold incredibly well, or that the Bieber songs didn't sell well. And I believe it's the first thing, which means that we're probably gonna see more 21 pilots in the future in Rock Band 4. But the number one spot this week is What I Like About You by The Romantics, which isn't a surprise since the song is pretty popular and well known for being 80s pop rock. The number two spot is a little more of a surprise. It's Redneck by Lamb of God. I did not know that this would sell as well as it did, but we'll see if it keeps it up for the next week. Number three is Dope Nose by Weezer, and I was pretty sure this would be number one or number two this week, but I guess I was wrong. Since it's a song that has been highly requested since it was in Guitar Hero Van Halen. Stressed Out is number 4, which means it's still in front of the Justin Bieber that is number 6, 8 and 10 this week. Boyfriend isn't even on the list. This kinda makes me think Bieber isn't selling as well as it did at the end of the last year and the beginning of this year. Hold the Mighty has fallen, right? Maybe this is some good news for the future of the DLC. Number 5 spot is Cake by the Ocean by DNCE. More or less the whole top 10 list except for the new DLC is Pop. Love Yourself by Justin Bieber is number 6. And Heels by The Weeknd is 7. Sore is number 8. And Still Believe by Frank Turner is 9. Which is the only non-pop except for the 3 new DLC this week. The first Justin Bieber pack is the 10th spot. Which I am a little bit surprised by. Since the last Justin Bieber single we got was in the top 10s for 2 months. And it seems like the pack is going off the top 10 list next week. But we'll have to see. The only new singles and packs that is on the top 50 list is The Bullet For My Valentine pack number 1 at the 48 and Mr. Brightside by The Killers at number 50. This makes me wonder if we're gonna get some more Bullet For My Valentine, since they did release a new album last year. And I would love if we get some songs from their older or their new album. I didn't like Temper Temper that much though. I think some more The Killers would be good too, since there is still some popular songs from them that is not in Rock Band 4 yet. But we will see what the future brings. Zombie by Cranberries is also at the 12th spot this week. And it's been high on the list since it released a little over a month ago. But to be honest I don't think we're gonna get much more The Cranberries. Because Zombie is pretty much their most popular song. And I think we have gotten more or less their biggest hits. But I think that's it for this video, I'll link the full list in the description if you want to watch it yourself. Make sure to like, share and subscribe if you want more Rock Band videos in the future. And comment what you thought about the list this week. I will see you guys later in the next video.